Hi, regular EV dad here. John, how are you? With my co-pilot, uh, junior regular EV. We'll work on that. Uh, quick review here of the uh, Willows, California, um, Electric America charging site. And there's good and bad. Um, first of all, from a charging point of view, phenomenal. We came in here at 6% in the ID4. Uh, it charged at 120, maximum 126 and just kept going 129 possibly. Um, and that's been awesome. Cute, isn't it? Don't be deceived. Uh, it's a it's a great layout in terms of how close it is to the Walmart. And I can personally, we can personally tell you that the restrooms are very clean. There's also a McDonald's literally by the front gate, not actually part of Walmart, which is has to be considered a good thing. Um, and <laughs> yes, uh, you get so much more in this channel. Um, but the layout of the charges is somewhat, mm. so we've got four charging units with eight heads, one of those being the Chadamo, two or three of them being 150s, and then four 350s. However, uh, I'm sat here on the far left facing out towards the road using the 150, uh, which means technically someone could be parked in the next bay and take that 150 around the unit. Perfectly normal, done it myself. However, the two, the uh, four 350 heads face in on one another. This is for what reason? There are literally four spaces. So whilst you've got eight heads, you can only charge four vehicles. There's no space for any other vehicles. There's no pull throughs. There's no trailer access. This is an issue. And then that brings about the question, why when you've only got four spaces, eight heads, and I'm afraid I have to say it's redundancy, not for capacity. Um, and I'd love to be wrong. The, the, the electrical uh, substation is the wrong word, but the electrical cabinetry is all contained here. They clearly have capacity to build out more. But why so many heads in such uh, with, 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 so, with so few spaces? Um, and I have to believe, and given my own personal experiences, this is a redundancy issue. Um, so, in short, very quick access from I-5, uh, less than two minutes from the freeway to the charging ports. Uh, restrooms, McDonald's right here on the other side of the freeway, coffee and more substantial meals should you wish. Um, this is a, a key piece of infrastructure for those heading north and south um, into Oregon or down into California. Um, and it does its job, but questions remain. Why so many heads, or redundancy, capacity or other? Uh, if you have questions, if you have answers, please uh, put them in the comments below. Otherwise, please subscribe to the channel uh, and uh, like this video if you can, if you wish. And I hope to see you again. Drive safe.